The UK's gaming industry has been estimated to be worth £3.86 billion, more than video and music combined. The Entertainment Retailers Association, who released those figures, suggest that only China, the USA, Japan and Germany are making more money from gaming. So what is helping the UK's youngest sector thrive? Graham Struthers, co-founder of UK-based independent games publisher Devolver Digital, puts an element of the UK success down to the industry forming very quickly and very early on. Video games are an art form and there's a general attraction to that in this country. So we've always been very successful. The gaming industry as it now exists formed around the same time back in the late 70s, early 80s. There were a small number of influential people in programming. That became the basis of game development and from that point on the UK has always had prominent games developers in every format. Skip forward a few decades to 2018 and Rockstar Games' latest release, Red Dead Redemption 2, has sold more than one million copies just in the UK. Yeah, he's a great horse, aside from when the devil got him. The game was made all over the world but the lead studio was in Edinburgh, in the hub of Rockstar North studio. The company is also behind the Grand Theft Auto and Max Payne franchises but it is not the only big player from the UK. Among the 2,260 other gaming companies based here are football manager creator Sports Interactive, Batman developer Rocksteady, Criterion Games who worked on Star Wars Battlefront 2, and Playground Games who co-created racing game franchise Forza. The UK gaming industry has not emerged out of the blue, but without time and money being put back into the industry, its current success and future growth is not guaranteed. In 2016 alone, the UK's games industry put 1.25 billion back into the development of new releases. And with over 20,000 jobs in the gaming industry in the UK, there have been calls for more education to help find a new generation of potential developers.